It is the largest multinational warfare exercise in the world. The U.S. is hosting the Rim of the Pacific Exercise, or RIMPAC, in Pearl Harbor, Hawaii. The U.S. Navy is using one of its newest ships during the drills, what's called a littoral combat ship. CCTV's Nathan King got a glimpse on board and reveals its capabilities. When it comes to cutting-edge naval technology for the 21st century, look no further than this. The USS Independence, a stealthy ship that, despite its size, can glide quietly onto an adversary's coastline and sit in just 15 feet of water. The ship's captain gave CCTV a tour of the ship and told us that the ship is so technologically advanced that it can fight with just six crew aboard. How proud are you of this ship's technology and capabilities? Oh, so very proud, and it really means so much for us to be here at RIMPAC uh, because for everything we've done so far, we really wanted to be able to demonstrate what the ship can do and what it can bring to the international environment. So being able to come here and work with our multinational partners really means so much to the officers and crew of the Independence. Your adversaries must be pretty scared of this ship. I mean, it's got so many capabilities, and it can be run by six guys? Pretty extraordinary that we're able to do so much with so few people. And, uh, and we demonstrate that every day. Driving the ship here from San Diego uh, with so few people has really been an extraordinary feat for the Navy. Is this the future of the Navy? Uh, well, I think we're learning an awful lot from this platform. So uh, there are lessons that come out of it every day. And uh, part of it is that we're learning some cultural things. So there are a lot of things that we've done in the past with very many people. We're doing here with very few people. And so as the technology gets better and we learn to trust that technology a little more, I think we're going to be a better, a better, smarter Navy for it. Now, littoral ships, of course, very much uh, in focus in South China Sea, East China Sea. Is that where you see a lot of your operations? Well, really, we can deploy this ship anywhere. So we've designed the ship where it is, uh, it is optimized in the littoral environment, but it can be sailed in the open ocean. And so uh, in, in the life of any ship, when you first build a ship, you have certain ideas of what you're going to use it for. And then once it becomes widespread in the fleet, then really the widespread Navy learns that they can do so much more with it.